Oh my god, that's a sheriff. Act natural. Howdy. Hey! Gentlemen. Hey! Oh, it's Mr. Braveway! There he is. Yep. This is the wife. Right here, this is the yeah. sheriff. Hello, uh, Dee. You missed a wonderful time. I'm just saying hello. Yeah. What the hell's the matter with you? Yeah. Um, me and uh, Dingleberry here are just uh, go, 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 rip. doing some uh, solid citizen stuff around the town. Uh, nothing uh, untoward at all. All right, it's clear. That's a good thing. I've had a lot of practice with this. How deep in these do they put bodies down? No, just keep fucking digging. Okay, okay. There is some money in here. I knew it! I knew that son of a bitch had some money. Uh, here's to, uh, the $40. The $40. Why does that raise suspicion? That's, wow, hey. that is very specifically worded away. I'm just making sure you're aware. That's all. All right, well... You enjoy yourself. Both he and I, we, we aren't on duty currently. We are on <laughs> That's good. That's perfect. Um, uh, what? Right, let's go. And what did that mean? I don't know. I guess. Hey, that was just back up there. That was smooth. You seen that? I oh, hope they didn't smell my hands. I shoved them in my pocket. Yeah, you just think a little natural. bit. I got to act natural. Act natural. Be like me. Be natural. Oh, my God. I should have washed my hands. You go to the back of the, the bank and wash yourself, for oh God's sake. God. Oh, my God. I ate the don't cheese after touching it. Oh, my God. Don't eat the cheese! Bad! Yeah! Let me ask you something, Bass. You know, would we consider ourselves friends, you know, because you were on a bachelor party and whatnot? Well, I would say, I mean, honestly, uh, friendships are built on trust, and uh, you did admit to be cheating at cards and gaming the money back, so yeah, Whoa, I said I we're friends. Admit, I didn't admit to cheating it, I gave you uh, a charity. I beg to differ, when you give out the money like that, that's, uh, that's, uh, that's guilt right there, but right. yeah. My guilt, Baz, is being kind, all right? I'm yeah, kind to you. All right. Yeah, kind is what you Speaking were. Speaking of which, wait, does anyone want to pay cloaker? We gotta work out a system, okay? We gotta work out a system. When you have like a, like a, an A, you you do the right. you, you cough, okay? Just go, <coughs> and then uh, when I have an A, I'll do two cough. I'll go, <coughs> and then if you have a king, you do three cough, and if I have a king, I do four cough. All right? I got it. Now we got a game. <laughs> Yeah, we sure do. Well, well, well. Yep, yeah, we'll check that. Well, that's pretty good. You chicken? <laughs> you see, Dinkleberry, he doesn't know what he's doing. Ugh, this ain't gonna be a free ride, Braveway. Well, this looks great for me, but I fold. Already. What? Give me a fold. I fold. I fold. You're checking again, eh, Braveway? Trying to play mind games, are we? <laughs> Let's see how you, you deal with this bet, huh? Now I've raised you five dollars. Right, here we go. All right. Are all you right, a man? Right, I call that bet. Let's get crazy. Oh, yeah. You got that king, Baz. You got that king. Oh, I don't know. Uh -oh. I guess we we'll have to find out, won't we? I don't know, I don't know about all that now. <laughs> all right, just you and I. Yeah, I knew you'd fold. Oh, I do. I'd pay for the pleasure. And let's play a game. Baz, oh, I, listen, no. I, don't know what, I don't know what you think you're getting into. No, he did, oh, he did well, 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 well. Okay, no, I had a nine as well. Okay, we were even there. Yeah, there. but I had a better nine, didn't I? Yes, I did. Yes, but there the cream always right rises now. to the top, lady. Well, this is extremely exciting, yeah. Extremely exciting. <laughs> I, I, I fold. I have. Play by what are you doing? You mean you're folding? I, I have nothing. Myself. What am I going to do? Okay. Let's do oh this. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Oh, you I'm thought that I wasn't any good, good, but you're learning, I'm aren't you? Huh? Oh, oh, I don't know about that. She, I don't like this. They're both very interesting. Interesting. Oh, you got two pairs. <laughs> yeah. Right. Though. Yeah. Oh, I appreciate the hundred dollars. Well, that was quick. Yeah. yeah. All right. It's Think a good thing you guys have a lot of money, I guess. Yep. Yeah. Our job here is done. All right. Let's ride. Are you riding already? Yeah, we'll do. Yep. Yeah. Appreciate that brief wait. <laughs> I'm gonna tell. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna What's tell that? Sadie all about that. That's what I'm gonna do. You should. Hey. Yeah. 
are y'all fellas doing? Uh, yeah, what are, what are y'all doing? What am I doing? I'm gonna head to the ranch so I can tell Sadie about uh, how much money I just made. I'm gonna take her on a fantastic adventure. We're on sabbatical here, so we're looking for stuff to do. If you wanna help us treasure hunt and whatnot, maybe, maybe you wanna bring the woman along, Bath? Maybe, yeah, that'd be great, yeah. All right. You can right tell the story right. about how I uh, destroyed you in the poker game there. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> good. Uh, but we're gonna gonna go to the ranch. See, uh, we could treasure. We could check the ranch for treasure. Maybe they have something very good. Yeah, that's a, yeah, yeah, that's a good idea. I don't think I've checked. Uh, carriage. Uh, you can watch out for these wagons. Wagon. Wagon. Yeah. <laughs> she was right. Hey, it just isn't right. your day, is it, Braithwaite? Is it your day at all? It's all going upside down and sideways. Uh, <laughs> just one of those days. Right yeah, after, yeah. after, right after the wife was telling me about riding there, that happened. That's interesting. Yeah, the wife and everything, you know. I'm trying to do something nice here, fellas. You know, for the thing, because uh, we on sabbatical. You know, because she suffered injuries, and mm. I ain't got a badge on me right now. But let me tell you something, fellas. Let me tell you something, pass. There's only so much you can push here, all right? Got that? So much. Is he, is he trying to be intimidating? If you, if you, let me, oh, let me hey, reassure you. Oh, oh, you hey, hey, all right, calm down. Calm down. Like I that. don't want to know. It wasn't embarrassing. Right. What are you talking about? The money's one thing. The money's one thing. Make sure you keep it in mind, huh? <laughs> all right, let's just do it. A little bit hostile, Dan. A little, little, little I angry. I didn't like that at all. I've heard that about him. <laughs> That's right. I was just, uh, <clears throat> you know, I had to let him uh, let up some steam there. Well, it's not wise to use your veteran skills on an officer of the law. Exactly. That's what he was trying to do. He was trying to bait me into making uh, something happen. That way he could put me in the, uh, the what's it called? The prison. Should we take it with us? Uh, it doesn't appear to be home. I mean, we should leave it at the doorstep, yeah? Just leave it at the doorstep. Right. Yeah. Should we leave a note? Uh, yeah. Yeah, you write the note. All right. Now, please begin dictation when you're ready. All right. <clears throat> All right. Dear Sadie, the apple of my eye. I bequeath to you this bison pelt and rabbit as my token of our future. Yours truly, the veteran Baz Kerrigan. How do you spell Kerrigan? Uh, just, just put Baz, just put Baz. Okay. Dear Sadie, the apple of my eye, I bequeath to you this bison pelt and rabbit as my token of our future. Yep. Perfect. You're truly the veteran Baz. Yep, yep, yep. You just put that right over there with the, uh, the stuff. And, uh, I'm just gonna love that. I'm still shocked. Though. Off 
duty lawman would be so physical with a, with a law-abiding... Oh, you're surprised by this, are you? I thought we were friends with that man, I guess not. Yeah, when you take a hundred dollars from you, him and his, his newly married well, wife... Well, that's not my fault, they stupid! All their money in two hands. What reason is there to keep playing? It would be mean if you did. Exactly. You gonna take more of their money? You'd be living in his mansion if he kept playing. <laughs> He's got a mansion? A huge mansion. His family is a, a giant farm down in Lemoyne. Oh, well, look at him, a little fancy boy, huh? A little fancy, yep. schmancy boy. Well, I imagine there's a oh. silver spoon planted deep down his mouth. Hello. Yeah, any friend of uh, oh. Barclays is a friend of mine, Mister. Dingleberry. Oh, go for it. Who's Dingleberry? Oh, hey. go for it. Not pronouncing your name wrong, Barclay. Hey. No, no, you're perfectly fine. Is that Dingleberry. Is she, is she calling you Barkley? What are you stupid? That's my. That's my first name. Oh, Barkley Dinkleberry, huh? Oglethorpe here is saying that you're a little bit of a gold miner, and I might have came across a gold mining site, and I was just uh, wondering if you could uh, instruct me on... <laughs> Talking way too loud about the gold mining in front of the saloon. Come with me. We're going to go somewhere where no one goes. Uh, what I was saying was I didn't realize the uh, gold was such a touchy subject. Are you fucking kidding me? You, you didn't know that gold is a touchy subject? What, are you insane? Well, I've always kind of had it, you know, given to me my entire life, and this is the first time I've had to actually go out and acquire things on my own, so... All right, all right. Well, tell me what you... Tell me what you got. Tell me what you got. Tell me information. Well, I just, uh, when I was fishing, I came across this gold... I think it was a gold panning area or site, and, uh, I didn't really know what to do there, so I was looking for somebody with some experience. All right, you found a gold pan in sight. I see, I see. Uh, I, I can help so. you out there if you want to learn the ways of the gold rush. I do. I, uh, I don't know what kind of equipment I would need or anything like that. <laughs> well, I can supply some equipment for a fee as well as the teaching fee. Why aren't you picking there? Yeah, hey, uh, yeah, yeah. You, uh, Princess, you can come start picking too. Get right up pick in it. here. Yep. Get right up in there and stop picking away. I've never seen active gold mining before. Yeah, you're witnessing something no. special. It's very Here we go. How you doing up there? Doing great. Finding good. Kinds of wonderful things. Yes. Let's take uh take my cut here. Alrighty. There you go, sir. I know. There you go. It doesn't cause a cave in. Money did you make after all uh, that? That is seventy dollars. But it's not bad. Well, the last suit didn't impress Sadie, so uh, maybe this one will. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, my friend just put on uh, this brand new. Look at his outfit. Yeah. What, was, what was this? Oh my. This is bad. It's bad. This is my friend Billy. Billy, this is bad. Howdy there, Bass. Hello, Bill. How He's you doing? one of the Howdy. best poker players in all of the. Yeah. Well, oh, I don't know, you the that's that's that what they bad. tell me. Oh, you? You ain't the best poker player. Oh, uh, yeah, you yet. should ask Mr. Braithwaite, who uh, is now, he's gone from rich to poor because of me. I don't really mean much to me. <laughs> you trying to imitate me? Huh? Never mind. Never mind. All right. All right. You ain't the best poker player around. Yeah, sure. Okay. Well, you know, I got $100 that would say otherwise. Uh, can I get a drink? All right. I'm looking fancy. She's gonna love it. Uh, Sadie's gonna. Wise, but you look dirty as hell. Yeah, women love that. <sighs> you tell uh, so we bad. were just out. Uh, Showed your hard mind what we were doing, but we were getting good and dirty. Yeah. <sighs> Sadie's gonna be like, "Oh, look at you, Baz. Yeah, I'll have your children. No problem." <laughs> That's absolutely what she's gonna say. Scotch. I ain't gonna drink scotch. Only one whiskey I wanna drink is American made whiskey. Hey, you were, you, were, you were him. I thought you were Australian. Was that Australian? Nice to me? Wow, That's not no, even no. a place. What are you talking about? 
Yeah. He was cheering along with uh, the. Uh, he was cheering along with the. Uh, him saying that's American. Well, anyone like can. Hey, 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 I can be. A, I can be an American. What's wrong with that? Why can't I be American? Do tell. Nah, I'm not saying you can. I'm just saying you see, we're, you fall in the Australian Civil War, so this is right, right. But now I live Make here. Are you saying that I'm not American? Hey, this man right here here is is living like he, he, in America. Uh, yep. Yeah, you fucking you tell him. This country, it is a big old melting pot. That's right. That's right. And I'm yeah, living the dream. Fucking America. It was a question. So I think you well, you just you're getting all aggressive against me because I'm Australian. He is American. All Sir? of us are bona fide Americans. Yeah. Sorry, I yeah, get no, real political when I drink. I do apologize. I was just pouring myself. I love America. And you must love business. Yeah. <laughs> I do. It's nice to meet you, sir. My name is Mr. Yeah, West. Likewise. Fine owner of West's Chicken Company. Canned chicken. Oh, my God. This guy's a fucking innovator. Patent working on it. I just need to, you know, come up with the supply. That's why I'm here in Valentine. Oh. I hear y'all a livestock town. Haven't found a single lick of chicken around oh, here. Oh, I don't you know, know what? All the place. I know where you can find some chicken. You said you knew where there was some chickens, yep. and where would that be? Uh, we can we can lead you there, me and Mr. Dinkleberry here. No, go for it. Yeah, I remember when you brought it. You got that one that you brought to the party, right? Yeah, party yeah that's exactly team. where we're going. We're gonna go there and get Mr. Westy's chickens, right? Right. Very good then. You gotta be careful though. These uh, roads are quite dangerous. Y'all got some pieces on you just in case? Absolutely. Hundred uh, percent. Some people don't agree with the way I acquire my chickens. Now, I like to get cage-free, grass-fed, Roman-free chickens. Yep, and yep. A lot of ranchers, they waste their chickens just waiting for their eggs. I know, but I know. A lot of plump, delicious chicken meat just waiting right exactly. there. Exactly. I liberate the chickens from ranches, and sheriffs look down upon that I sort think, of thing. I think I know what you, 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 you're doing here, and I like it, because that's exactly what we're doing. We're going to a little ranchy. Oh, so you know, <laughs> a good one. All right. Ugh. All right. Dinkleberry will, uh, will guide us in there. Where are we going to meet him? Out in the front? Yeah, out the front there. Very good. Now, thank you for sticking up for me in there, by the way. That fella, that Bob, was really uh, agitated for some reason about me being Australian. Oh, of course, partner. Once you hear you're an American, a full-blooded American, ain't no one going to tell you anyways or anyhow. What in the hell is the matter with you? Shut up, right. dickhead! How are you enjoying America? Here we go. Oh, it's great. I'm living the dream. Making money all over the place, actually. I'm a bit of a, I guess I'm like you. I'm a bit of an, uh, what do you call it? An entrepreneur. Entrepreneur, yeah. yeah that's it, that's interest. me. I just uh, put the, the wagon under these trees over here, inconspicuous like. Yeah, right here, right here. Beautiful. All right. Let's get ourselves some chickens. I work on this ranch, so, uh, you know, you can really have whatever you like, honestly. You have, you have my permission. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'll go just get them for you, Mr. West. Sounds excellent. Wow, look at all those chickens. Hello, chickens. Yeah. Yeah. Make sure you ask for the next. Yeah. yeah. He's very accurate. Yeah. I can tell. Very good. And Hell one more. Man. One more. Oh. Give me your little chicken. Yeah. All right. All right, let's get to work. Oh. Beautifully done. Beautifully done. We're going to have a lot of chicken for our canned chicken. Bath? Yeah. You sure this is okay? I mean, why not? It's business, right? Okay. okay. As long as you say so. Yeah, I got a bad shoulder, so you can throw it in there. Yep. Uh, I'll just go get the other chickens. Uh, Dingleberry handled that. Oh, yeah. no. Go ahead, Dingleberry. Put yeah. them in the Have back. fun with that, Dingleberry. So, uh, how much are these chickens worth to you, by the way? I mean, they talk about the business part portion here. Now I've delivered the goods, as promised. Of course. Well, a chicken will catch about $3. Depending upon the quality, of course. Oh, these, are high, these, probably, are the, these are the highest quality. Highest quality. This is going to fetch about $3 at the market. Nice, nice. Okay. That's a good compensation right there. And then I take the meat and then I process it 
Yeah. Can it. Yeah. And yeah. then he'll resell it for five dollars. Are there uh, any left? Yeah, there's one more, Dinkleberry. Might be full. He's already full. We gotta shove those chickens a little further in the bag. They like that. Yeah, yeah, they're gonna to jiggle around, around in there, Dinkleberry. Gotta find the right ogles. We can find the right spot here, but it doesn't say I need me a little more room. But I'll get these two on it. I was gonna go ahead and put these a little further back. All right, I'm just gonna check something. Oh, I'll, I'll be right back. I think he did the right notes. It has the right number of letters, I guess. Hello there! Oh. Hi. How you doing? Anyone at home then? Uh, no, we're just heading out. Uh, I came over here to check, but no one's here, unfortunately. Yeah, I'll be right back. Oh, that's his friend. <laughs> Start riding out right now, I told you. Oh, okay. Who's that? Alright. Well, are you gonna be hanging around here long? Who's that long? Oh, that? Oh, that's a, that's a friend. What's in the back of that wagon? What's in the back of that? I've got no idea. I don't know. And just, you know, let me just have a look over there, let me see. I, I can't quite see what's in there, actually. I've only got one eye. Fuck. Oh, well. I've got pretty good eyes. I'm sure you do, don't you? So what'd you see, then? Well, I reckon if I take a wander over to that little house, might be a case of what I don't see, Baz. What? What are you doing? Uh, you don't have to go over there. Oh, you see anything missing? Oh my god. They must have flown out of the coop here. Shit. Straight in the back of a fucking wagon, eh? Nah, nah, nah. They flew. They flew. They might have... They might have heard every, every, like, once a year. They all fly the same direction and they, uh, they breathe. What the fucking hell do you think Sadie's gonna think? What do you mean, Sadie? Don't you bring up Sadie in this. What are you talking about? You coming in here? Hey, hey, you accusing me of doing what? Steal their chickens. I didn't steal no chicken. Where's your evidence? Well, there is no evidence, is there? There's no evidence at all. Yeah, all it takes is a word, Baz. Oh, a word? What are you gonna tell him, hmm? You gonna lie? You gonna besmirch no. me? Is that what you gonna do? No, Bess. Yeah, I what? Where can your desire for romance bring the honesty out of you? You come back here right now! Fuck! Come with me! Ah! Yeah, you fucking horse! What are you related to fucking mango? No! Ah! Yeah. <clears throat> All right, all right, fair enough, you fucking little shit. Uh, 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 don't listen to anything this man has to say. This guy is accusing, is accusing, is an, is an accuser. That's what he is. So what is he accusing of? The only thing he's accused me of is my wagon missing a chicken. Yeah, he's, he's chickens, you understand? That's right, Pass. Well, I hope there is no misunderstanding going on here. There have been no accusations made against your name, Ben. He was making accusations against me over by the ranch, saying that he's going to talk to Sadie and tell her besmirchments. Uh, I told you the opposite. I said your desire of romance might lead to you being honest. What's that supposed to fucking mean? You're being all fucking suspicious. I'm just worried about you, Baz. Oh, you're worried about me? Well, lucky for me, I've got, I've got such a good friend like you to look after me. Ain't that the truth? Yeah, yeah. So what do you want, exactly? I don't want anything. Oh, yeah? So what are you doing here then? Snooping about, being all creepy? I'm just keeping an eye on folks. I'll check on the cattle. You check on the cattle? The chickens. Well... Well, you're not doing a very good job there, are you? Because you let him fly the coop. The chickens, you, you, you let him fly the coop over there. That's unfortunate. 
Well, this was none mine. of my business. But now it seems like it is my business. So you keep track of the chickens and the cows. And what's it to you? And you tell him, West. Why don't you go uh, ahead and tell me whether or not this is going to be an issue? Like I said, it's only going to be an issue for Baz and his romance. And... Oh, you're threatening me now, huh? No. Don't threaten him, Baz. You might regret it. Hey, friend. I don't know who you're representing or who you're looking out for with these chickens, but don't stick your nose in business that don't concern you. Mm. Well, for now, you can enjoy your chickens. For now, I will. And after that, I will. You don't get to dictate what I enjoy. Oh, this is America. This is America, sir. Don't know where you think you're living. Yeah. Well, a good day, and please take heed of what I said. Yeah, you heard Have the man. Yeah, take care of yourself, Mr. Whisper. I don't understand what the big deal is. You clearly, like you said, have full permission. That son of a bitch. Now we ought to be careful going into Valentine. Who knows what else? has transpired since the ranch. He might have tipped off every deputy and sheriff in Valentine. Yeah, but there's no evidence, West. There's no evidence. No, there isn't, no. But look mighty suspicious still. A couple of chickens in the back of a wagon. I think it'd be good. You ride into town with them turkeys. Yep. Go ahead and sell them at the butcher. Yep. Scope the place out. See if there any sheriff or deputy hanging around there. Come back if it's safe. Drop the load off and... All right, where do you want me to meet you? Just meet me by the station. Too bad. Any reports about uh, anything? There are lots of reports about everything. Uh, anything about uh, <clears throat> chickens? Chickens? What do you mean? Ah, that's good. All right, Mr. West, you should be fine to make your delivery. Very good. I give a check in. Hey, Dinkleberry. Dinkleberry. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Uh, just to, uh, just to be safe, because I don't trust Stone, uh, just, uh, don't tell anyone about the chickens, okay? Okay, just act like I don't know what he's talking about. Yeah, just act like you don't know what he's talking about. Okay. Alright, there was no chickens, and the only chickens that we, that, that Mr. West had were chickens that he picked up elsewhere, okay? Don't mention the ranch, don't bring up the ranch, none of that, alright? Alright, got it. Ah, oh, fuck! Your outfit look a little, little gross there. Yeah, fucking great, great. Hey, fella. Be. What do you got? We got some. Well, we got stew. Uh, in memory of Buford. Did oh, for Buford's, fuck's uh, sake, with Buford or again, seriously? What are you talking about? I only just made it yesterday. <sighs> Me, I mean, made of every animal to try to kill him. It's on the sign there. Got <sighs> gator, bear, uh, cougar, you, yeah. crocodile. I don't want all to in the same stew, stew Jimmy. Well, it's a whole look, lot of meat I, it in a single fucking, fucking idea, stew. Right? It was everyone else's idea. It's a terrible fucking out. idea. You're naming a stew well, after people him. People seem to fucking like it, all right? So don't you worry about it's it. Calm down, right? You're a little, little agitated. Calm yeah. down. Who was gonna feel about eating no stew after a big fucking fella like me? I don't that's know right. That's right. right. Well, if any of you are hunters, I, I always pay for people that are going out to get bring me back more meat. Oh, is that right? If it's particularly interesting, or it's very interesting, do we get more money? It's fifteen dollars flat rate, unless. Okay. It's... Oh, sorry. Fifteen dollars for something interesting? Hell, I'll give him something interesting. All right, piggies. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, yeah. stay in there. Yeah. Come here, you little pig. Yeah. I said, stay in there, damn it. Yeah, keep him still. Keep him still. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Go on, get him, he's running. 
He's dead. All right, good. Let's load it up. All right. Dingleberry, there you go. Oh, look at that. <laughs> that was good. There you go. Look at that. I'm gonna get oh, the donkey. Nope. We get one more try. Yeah, go ahead and get that donkey. I ain't sure we're gonna be able to fit it in here. Guess we're gonna find out though. Holy fucking shit! Did you get him? Oh, that was the toughest fucking donkey that's ever lived. Hey, uh, Mr. West, you wouldn't mind if I kept one of those pigs, would you? What's that? You wouldn't mind if I kept one of them, them pigs, would you? Not at all. It could be a part of your cut. I gotta figure out how much it's gonna give us for each pig. Then I'll divide it up by three. Yeah, yeah, okay. Hey, I'll take this one. This would be this would be the one I keep. That's for Sadie. Whoa! I brought you the meat that you desire. Some exciting, fresh uh, meat. Yes. Perfect. Watch you bring me. A donkey. Are you alright, man? A, a donkey? Yeah, a donkey. You said the better, the interesting the meat, the better, and the the what? more monies you give me. It's just the most American meal you'll ever have. I mean, I'll, I'll serve a lot of shit. Before. I suppose I could serve a donkey. This. Yep, yep. And you know what? It has something in common with Buford. They're both asses. <laughs> All right, who am I paying? Me. Yeah, where did you find the donkey? In the wild. Wild Poor thing donkey. was a wild yeah, fucking donkey. Wild donkey. Where do you think they, where do you think they come pig from? Over there. Was that pig wild too? Of course. Can you attest to the wildness of this donkey and the pig on the back of that horse over there? Uh, I can take a look. And then you're right Hold there. On. You were there in the wild, Dingleberry, when we when we captured the the beasts. That was your name. Who's Dingleberry? Dingleberry? Seen better days, ain't it? How'd you kill it anyway? You shoot it? Oh uh, no, yeah, nothing no. inhumane no, like a knife, that. A knife, actually. It's, Don't uh, mind the, the 20 holes all over. Those were all stab wounds. Yeah. A mighty fine hall, I'll see then. Yeah. Gentlemen, the uh, law really want to speak to you about that pig, the donkey, and then also buy some chickens. Ah, what well. the fuck did you tell them? I didn't tell them anything. I said I was urinating, and when I came back, you found out. Know. You were over there yeah. in the distance. You are talking to him for quite a while, Dingleberry. No, How do they know about no damn chickens. What you say about the chickens, Dingleberry? Uh, I didn't huh? say anything. I said uh, you uh, said uh, he wants to speak to you about chickens. That's all. And I said, well, I can go find them if you'd like. They're all behind. What the fuck they talking about chickens How for? How the hell did he find out about the chicken? Uh, anything about uh, <clears throat> chickens? Chickens? What do you mean? Excuse I'm me, sure sir. Can I help you? I, from who? I couldn't help but oh, over here. Stone. I am yeah. also in wildlife acquisitions. You need nothing wild... about nothing, okay? If I hear the word chicken come out of your fucking lips, you're gonna get the backhand from down under, you understand? All right. All right. I'm gonna talk to the fucking deputy and clear this up once and for all. Best. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, I'm good. How are you? I'm just gonna go get myself a little bandage. That'll be fine. All right, well, I was hoping I could have a conversation with you. With me? Yeah, just about a couple of things. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let me just get my bandage and I'll be right yeah, with you sure. in, this, in a moment. Yeah. yeah, I'll be waiting for you just here on the porch. All right. Not going to help you. Well, would you like to? You wouldn't mind stepping into the office, would you? Inside? Yeah, all right. I'll, I'll get car. Just, yeah. uh, would, would you like to take a seat? Yeah, I'll take a seat, yeah, alright. How do you take a seat? Yeah, no, you know, I'll, I'll prefer to stand, actually. No, you want to stand? Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, let's stand. So, so, my first question is, you came up to me early and you asked about some reports regarding chickens. Yep. How, how, how come? Hey, hey, wait, hey, excuse me, sir. That's my pig. What are you doing? Hey, you fucking pig. This is a well fat pig. How the hell you find the pig? I found that in the wild. Wow. That's for my love. Thank you very much. That's for that's for Sadie, the pretty lady, and I appreciate it. You put that back outside. Pig. I put it on the damn floor. 
No, I don't. Ex excuse me. I don't. You bring in a pig to a woman? <laughs> yeah, 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 they love they love pigs. Have you not heard? No, I did not. Yeah, well, maybe that's why I'm going to be married and you're going to be, be uh, all by your lonesome Sir, with all these you boys with your life. Many other feline attributes. What's that? Are you exhibiting other feline attributes? Feline attributes? Is that some kind of fucking talk for cat? Yeah, cats leave. leave I don't know, like cats. Crazy. They're fucking snakes with fur. They're fucking serpents. I prefer if you didn't bring them up, okay? Thank you very much. All right, well, you're the one acting like a goddamn cat. No, no, the thing is, I had that time with my fucking horse. That, that pig is my property, and you took it off. These ladies you want to court. The fuck are you Excuse talking about? Excuse me. <laughs> Yes, Mr. So Price. anyway, hey, back to the me? question, Baz. The chickens. Why, why did you ask about that? Ask about the chickens? Because yeah, I, the report on chickens. Because there was some crazy fella whispering away, talking about chickens and how he's going to tell people about chickens. So I came into town worried that he was going to start spreading some fucking falsehoods and besmirchment. And I was just asking, that's all. Is that a, is that a crime? I'm sorry. No, that's not a crime. That's not a crime at all. I was just... Uh, because uh, so you asked me that, then I headed out to the, the ranches down in the east. Okay. And the fella out there was telling me that somebody was taking chickens. Oh, that's interesting. Was he whispering like this? Was he like... Was he like that? Well, I presume we're on the same page. That then. fella is a liar uh, and a besmircher and he's full of falsehoods. If I may, I believe this is all one very big misunderstanding and I would very much like to clear the air. You see, I come down from Saint Denis over to Valentine in search of procuring some chickens, yep. purchasing them, mind you. I had a cart filled with chickens that I had purchased from a ranch that Baz was affiliated with. Yep. We were rolling through Emerald to see if we could find the ranch and or owner of that ranch to discuss buying chickens correct for the sole purpose of canning them for adventurers cowpoke chefs america's best and breast chicken can I, I presume you have do you have any kind of documentation for this this chicken documentation for chicken my good sir that simply doesn't <laughs> exist do you even know anything about you know chicken delivery sir i think you do do you i have no idea about chicken deliveries no but i presume is it just a gentleman's agreement or is the documentation? I presume not. Documentation for a chicken be a silly thing. <laughs> if it was a cow or a steer, possibly for its lineage. Yep. A beef cow, you want to make sure it's got big, strong, sturdy. Yep. Steer before you bring it on over to your farm for chickens. <laughs> now, chickens ain't worth it. Well, what about no, a stout I mean, pig like the one right Excuse here? me, sir. We'll talk about the pig later, okay, with your thievery, all right? It's all misconstrued. And the one who tipped you off is not all there in the head. Yep, he's a, he's a little creepy, you know, hiding, right. in the, hiding in the shrubbery, whispering. Now, I'm not familiar with what it is his uh, relation to Baz is, but apparently it's something fierce. He's jealous that Sadie has fallen for me, and he said he was going to tell Sadie that I'd done something with some chickens, and he was going to tell everybody and ruin my relationship so she wouldn't marry me. It's all a big conspiracy. So that, that that's fine by me. That That's cleared the air for me. If that that is, Fantastic. you know, your chicken business, that I'm fine with that. Let's talk about the pig. Oh, the fucking pig now. I told you where I found the pig and the wild, unless you I have wait, some kind you of did, evidence. You just said out in the wild. Could you give me a clearer description of where these wild, fat, well fed well, I was uh, well, riding around. in the woods and I heard a squeal and uh, I saw your mother in there and the pig was right next to it. Oh, now he's just oh. a little emotional. I'm, I'm a little, a little emotional. Okay. He is son of a bitch is still in my present for my darling, can my darling. Can I, can woods? Can I explain what? what it was the woods to the south. Someone else's pig. I mean, do you know who it is, right? or do you just plan to uh, give it a funeral next to fucking Buford up in the cemetery there? Maybe, maybe name a stew after it. I don't know. What the fuck are you gonna do with it? I think my friend Baz here just happened to stumble upon a lost truffle pig. And took advantage of the situation. Yeah. Now, if you can identify the owner of that pig, then we'll be more than welcome to pay reparations to that yeah. owner for his deceased more truffle More than pig. happy. Do you have the name at all? No, I don't. This is the ah, first time here. Ah, that's a shame. 
done yeah. found a wild truffle pig, presumably Oh, I'm sure the two of you pig. think it's real clear, even though Baz here has been changing his story every time. I want my you, fucking Mr. pig. I want to take it to Sadie. Here. Like I Wait, said, Baz, Baz is a little emotional because he's got a woman in his life yeah. that he's fighting real hard for. And that pig, yeah. that pig is a gift to his love. You can love it. Jesus Christ, get this fucking pig out of my office. Hey, how about me, we cut how about we cut a deal here? We'll get this pig out of your office. We'll get out of your head. If I get any fucking word, a truffle pig's gone missing, donkey's gone missing, you two are fucking suspects number one and number two right here. Uh, I see Sadie's horse anyway. I don't see her uh, either. Maybe he knows. Stone? How you doing, gentlemen? Not too Hi. bad. Where's Sadie? I've not seen anyone yet. So, uh, Stone, you've been telling stories, huh? I don't tell stories, Baz. Oh, you told stories to the, uh, the deputies. That's what you did. I think you'll find you're mistaken. No, I don't think I am. They told me. They, uh, they pulled me aside, had a talk to me, said they spoke to you here at the ranch. That's right. Yeah, I think you said you didn't say nothing. And here you are, flapping your gums. I told them they were looking for rustlers. Oh, they're looking for wrestlers. Oh, really? That's right. Do you make it a point to tell law enforcement stories? Hmm. Well, it's a little bit difficult. What oh, is it? When there's a fucking coop full of missing chickens. Oh, the coop. Oh, yeah. I didn't. I forgot that your your whole job is to protect the chickens. Yeah, but you failed at that. That's interesting. Oh, well, I'm relying on the honesty of your heart, Baz. The honesty of my heart. You're telling lies about me, and you are trying to get into uh, the middle of me and Sadie, is what you're trying to do. I'm trying to do nothing in the soul. I don't give a shit. Oh, really? So then why the fuck did you say that you're going to, you know, it's going to be up to Sadie, and how my love is going to dictate the truth, uh, all this shit, like it's your fucking business when it's not. It's your fucking choice, Baz. I mean, is it my choice, though? I ain't tell nobody nothing. I mean, I was here... Except that there's some chickens missing. Oh, yeah, I know. And then you made it a point to go tell the deputy. No. How'd they, they get my here. name, then? Hmm? I don't fucking know, Baz. If you think that, you're a fucking idiot. Oh, I'm an idiot, am I? Like, I'm gonna give a shit about some chickens. Well, you obviously cared enough to fucking follow us to Emerald. I just wanted to make I sure I knew more facts. Yeah, your facts. Your facts ain't the truth. Oh, is that right? That's right. Your word means fucking shit. Well, it means a lot to a lot of other folks who do a shitload more than steal fucking chicken. I didn't steal no fucking chickens. You got no evidence of that. That is besmirchment and lies. I give a shit. It's only besmirchment and lies. If I told someone you did that, I'm telling you you did that. You know you fucking did that. Yeah. I don't give a shit about it. Yeah, you sound like you care very much. I care for your heart, Baz. For my heart? Really? Yeah. What about it? Well, looks like it might be taking a dark little turn. No. Uh, his heart is full of love. And I'm doing what I gotta do to supply a future to my future wife and mother of my child. Well, have fun with that. If you carry on doing this shit, you're gonna end up dead or banged up. It's you who's besmirching me now, Liz. 
Then I would talk to the law about that. You did talk to the law. law. That's a name. fact. That's a fact. I gave no names, no descriptions, no times. I just said there's some fucking chickens missing. Did you uh, did you cry? <laughs> did you shed a tear for the chickens? I don't give a flying fuck about the chickens. Did you tell them how much you're sad the chickens are gone and they flew the coop? If that makes you happier, Baz, yeah, why not? When you see Sadie, tell her I got a fucking hog for her, right? Oh, I reckon you'll probably see her before me, Baz. I hope so. I surely do. Anything else I can help you gentlemen with now? Nah. We're all through. Nice pig. 